Greetings, my name's Kelly Mulholland, and this is my wife Donna, and we call ourselves Still on the Hill. Uh, we are a folk duo, and we've been traveling the country for about 20 years now, playing songs that we've written. Our anchor actually has become story songs about folks that we've met in the Ozark Mountains, where we live. Yeah, and just when you thought all the great folk art stories had been told, along comes Ed Stilley, the preacher man of Hogscald Holler, Arkansas. Isolated deep in the Ozark Hills, Ed lived his life as if the second half of the 20th century had never happened. And on the basis of a mysterious directive from God, he created over 200 musical instruments and gave them all away, mostly to children. Made entirely from wood scraps and metallic odds and ends, every one of these rough-hewn creations is utterly unique and a masterful piece of art. It's interesting that Ed Stilley himself had no need or desire for recognition. His motivation was really one entirely of devotion. As a folk duo, we write lots of songs, but we never expected to be writing a book. But here we are. That's true. And our book, True Faith, True Light, The Devotional Art of Ed Stilley, published by the University of Arkansas Press, will make Ed's art and story available to the rest of the world at last. It's a beautiful hardbound book that documents Ed's life and process, along with exquisite photos and x-rays of his instruments. I suppose this book was actually born of necessity. It's simply a story that had to be told, and we are very honored to be the ones who could tell it. Mm -hmm.